Welcome back everyone to my kitchen. Today I want to make fresh guacamole. It's so simple to make and I'll do the basic recipe and you can double it or quadruple it as needed. Two avocados, fresh lime, one tomato, salt and pepper, an onion, go with purple if you prefer, and a little bit of sour cream. Start by scoring and smashing the avocados. These are beauties. You can also skip the scoring step and just scoop it out with a spoon, but I find it makes it a lot easier. Now I'm just gonna empty them right out into the bowl. They come really beautifully out of the skin. And we're gonna get some lime on them as soon as possible so they don't go brown. As soon as the avocados are open, they start getting brown, so we wanna get some lime or lemon on there as soon as possible. So just squirt as much lime on there as your family enjoys. We like at least half a lime. Now we're gonna add salt and pepper. Be quite liberal but with both, but especially the salt. Now we're going to smash. Should have had a bigger bowl. Anytime you like, you can add one dollop of sour cream. Feel free to add more if you like, but one dollop usually does it for us. Continue smashing everything up and trying not to taste it <laughs> because once you start eating it, you can't stop. Give it a bit of a taste at this point. Mm. Set it aside and get your onion in there. And you want to do your onion really small. A little bit of raw onion just adds that extra zest. Time for the tomato. Go with little small chunks. Of course up in New York you'll be having fresh tomato right now and that'll be just divine. This isn't vine ripened and you can tell. You don't want the extra water of the tomato so just lift it off or give it a bit of a drain first. Now just mix everything together. Some people prefer to pop the whole thing in a blender right now so it's super smooth like the store-bought kind. Our family just loves that extra texture um, of little lumps and cubes and it's just so yummy. It's going to be time for a taste now. Yum. Mm. I think it wants a little bit more salt and pepper. And maybe just a little squeeze of lime. All right, let's see what that's like now. Mm, perfect. So that's really all there is to it. It's such a simple dish. So quick to be prepared. It's a great accompaniment for chips and tortillas. It'll be the star of any show and so easy to make. Add a little chili if you like it hotter, but let me know how you go and what your family's best ingredients are to add. Drop them in the comments and have fun. Let's guac.